just goes up and around. This one just goes back to Scorch. This one does. Right, he just leans like a boss. Oh! What? What is... What is Solar Flare hat? It must be Scorch. Even more Spore, I think she would have just thrown out there to prevent us from drawing a card! What did we just get? Oh, it's a Corvée card! Okay, I have to read this thing again. I'm not up to date here. What's going on, everybody? This is Fry. So today we are doing the See Me Growing. This is the deck that we are using. Uh, it is like a very tempo-y, fast side kind of deck. You can notice that the curve is very, very low. The curve only goes up to four, but we are running a whole lot of card draw. Uh, Imp Commander with some imps. Uh, we're running Doctor Who Cares, and for some even more card draw, we are running a Cheese Cutter. Now, uh, the smart thing I could have done in this deck is remove four Cheese Cutters and put in four Imposters. It is definitely, uh, in general, it's a better card than Cheese Cutter, and uh, we are running Toxic Waste and Pen, a whole Imp combo. So, if you, again, if you want to make this deck better, uh, and if, I might actually do that if this deck does not perform well, take out the Cheese Cutters and put in Imposter. Uh, but I want to really run Cheese Cutter because it's more fun! And because this deck is called See Me Growing, so it's, a, it's definitely a more fun card, and it works very well with Doctor Who. Uh, anyway, Pogos are for removal. You try to really grow either your Imp Throwing Imp or your Rooster or your Doctor Who. These are three really, really great cards to either be growing with any of these growing cards. Uh, then you just start bouncing things off the field, and you can actually draw a lot of cards with the Space Cowboy if you have an Imp Commander on the field. I think this deck could do very, very well. I hope we don't run out of cards. We do have, again, plenty of card draw. Let's see how it does. Here we go. They see me growing. Swing. This is called Growing Dirty. Ooh, maybe I should have called it Growing Dirty. Okay, that'll be our inside joke, you guys. Don't tell YouTube. I'm going to edit this part out. No, it's, this part's definitely not going to get edited out, so... YouTube, you guys are in on the joke, too. It's very exciting. Very exciting, you guys. Cosmic Imp should be a 2-2. Two -two. Oh, I could see Cosmic Imp being better if it had a little better stats. I'm not, I've really never used it. Okay. Uh, let's, is, is there a difference for Chompzilla between these two cards? In general, Doctor Who is the better card. Uh, if we had a little... Ooh, maybe keep both of them? Imp throwing imp could be very good though. Um, let's look for a one maybe. Oh, we got a one! Wow, we. If this chumzilla does not have an answer to this cheese cutter right now, we are in great shape. I think this is actually going to go here. The Doctor Who might want to go on height so it doesn't get scorched. Let's see if he either has super or an answer. No, it doesn't have an immediate. Okay, it's not an immediate answer. Um, the thing about this, he might stick a P behind this next turn, then Doctor Who is going to hit face. Let's see if there's a better option. I think let's go with this, and Doctor Who is going to... See, we are running three copies of uh, Area Area 55, or whatever it's called, um, which really is very good with this. Should I play around in an environment that we don't have yet? His environments are kind of good to clog, too. Oh, what do we do? Other option just to bounce this turn. Let's do this. Scorch, score. I don't want to get scorched. We're probably going to end up growing the Doctor Who next turn. Growing cheese cutters, by the way, is amazing, too. So then I have to make really inefficient trades to make sure you're not hitting face. And there's that. All right, we're drawing. We're good. So again, we're losing a... No, it's one for one, plus we're drawing a card. Perfect. Ducky, yes. Oh, the Ducky Tube is going to be so good against Chumzilla. There's no amphibious minions. Come on, man. Uh, so we're gonna, this is how you ducky, this is, this is how you ducky. Uh, there's two ways to do this. I think the way is actually, oh no, we're gonna put the, this guy right here. Oh yeah. So what are we growing? So this, we'll actually get this back in our hand, which is kind of more card draw. I think growing this is better. The stats are, are better. We don't want this also getting Chumzilla powered ever. This is a 3-7. 1-5, think about it. 1-5 is like 2-4, is like 3-3, three, three, basically worth of stats on turn 2. So this this card, just the stats are overpowered. It only, you can only really utilize that when you grow it. So the, the Doctor Who's are just insane in this deck. That's going to draw us another card. We have such a huge card advantage right now, including this will kill the this dude. We'll take 2 damage, and then we get another card in our hand. It's just amazing. Definitely take it. Here's <laughs> here's the area. We got another free imp. That's really awesome. The free imps are real. Um, I'm seeing this as a buff self play, maybe. We also could possibly blow. I think it's going to be like this, like 
this and then blow. We're probably going to end up buffing self to just take out this repeater. Uh, if he grows the repeater, we're just going to blow it and probably just grow the... I don't even know. We'll grow the ducky, probably. Nice to spread... You know, you don't want to get squashed, so it's nice to kind of spread out the where you distribute your grows. We are in such good shape in this match here. Look at this! It's amazing! Uh, we're gonna... Oh! Oh, oh no! We gotta kill that. <laughs> this is definitely our priority. We have to kill... <laughs> I didn't play around this. Ooh, do I... Do I blow here? Okay, if we blow the, the okay, if we blow this, it's not so bad because it's gonna have to replay it. Uh, we'll hit damage for three more faces. Blowing either one of these is amazing. We're, we're this is as good of a dolphin yarn. Either we don't really want man, that's the one we didn't want to get. Um, we really wanted to get the repeater. Uh, now he has the pod father in his hand. Unfortunately, this is gonna go. We're still in really good shape though, and we can we're gonna have to set up this pogo, I guess now. Come on, man. There's Scorch. Come on, man! Look! Grow, because why the heck not? Yeah. There you go. There you go! Let's see what's in the box. Ooh, more Dr. Usage. Okay, this'll take this out and bounce something out of the way. It'll probably make us draw another card with Dr. Who this turn. Which is really nice. This is a 5-5 five, five ducky. It's 5-5 five, five and growing. Yeah, guys. Pogo's the play. Good call time warp. Uh, is Bra Brain Freeze a good hero, Monsieur? Um, it's, he is a good hero. He's sneaky. Just, the, again, the beastie is bad and the sneaky is the bad. Beast, sneaky is really the best. And what is this? Oh, Okay. So he healed himself. Oh, wow, that was a really slow play. Why did he not play? Why did he not play the Podfather there? I'm really confused because it draws us another card. Yay! Transformation Station. Here we go. Super takes out the Pogo, I guess, or Geyser. Super. So he's doing. Okay, so we're gonna be down to six. It's not a super comfy position, but it's not bad. He's gonna be down to three though, and we blocked there. Acid rain. We'll do that next turn. What did we have this turn actually? We pogo. We had five, six. Yeah, we're, we'll use this next turn. It's gonna be based. The play is probably gonna be um, loudmouth, Doctor Who, and then acid rain. And we can acid rain that repeat. If he doesn't grow this or protect it somehow, we're gonna just acid rain that all the way down. And we can, so we can gr really acid rain and then grow this. Yeah, we're in really good shape. What's going on? Oh my god. Thank you so much. You guys are so nice. Thanks, X Nate. Yeah, I'm a big believer of the. Oh, that's dangerous. Damn, the only healed face, though. Okay. So we're gonna acid rain, which means we grow. This is weird, but I ain't... I'm actually gonna grow this one. I... This is really his, his shot. We're gonna acid rain to take this out because we don't want to take any more heat from that repeater. Uh, I really have to kill. I don't want him just using a. If, in case we don't win here, no. Ah, didn't want. If I would have grown one of these, that would have been lethal. I didn't think that the blocks would work out that well. Now it's not. He could win if he has another heart at choke. Just heart at choke. What's it called? He's drawing more cards. Heart at choke. Taco wins on his side. This would be really sad if he could pull off the victory just because these little bits of damage he's been doing here. Uh, Pogo's definitely the play. In case he does some, something weird with a Bananasaurus Rex or something like that. There you go. Pogo should win. Or if he clogs all five lanes, it's impossible. There's no amphibious minions. Uh, looks like we got this one. <laughs> he didn't end up replaying that Podfather, so no biggity. No biggity dog. And that's lethal. The man's trying to heal. Not gonna work. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. I wanted area 22 there for BM. Come on, man. Come on, man. Wanna know. Ooh, didn't win that as convincingly as I would have wanted to, though. Despite all of our cards and the card advantage, he was able to plug a lot of damage in that game, so. It was really the repeater I ended up doing a lot. I should have killed that repeater a little earlier. He got a really lucky bounce us getting the... It would have been nice to bounce the repeater on that or the... Anyway. 
Pogo is your favorite card. It's a pretty good one. Fry is Area 22 good. It's good in this deck because of the, you know, it's there's a bunch of very good cards to play on. Particularly Doctor Who. I mean, Doctor Who is... I don't use him enough. I really had the idea yesterday, like, whoa, I haven't used Doctor Who in a long time, except for an R and Jesus HD, of course. Um, but, I was like, have to use him. Can I make this deck? Nice shiny cards. What do you mean? Like cards I rarely use? What is going on with the Nox? Why is it lagging today? One, two, three. Did we keep second uh, Imp Commander here? Um, a Pogo would be nice. Uh, one of our fours would be nice. An environment would be nice. It's nice to actually have an, a variety of... This is fine. This is really good. Kill my father. Prepare to die. I need more environments, even with Dr. Space Time. Three is like the minimum you put in a deck. We could run a fourth one. I could run another Area 20, fourth Area 22. Problem is the environments are very circumstantial. I could take out a goat and put in an Area 22. Unfortunately, he had that piece of trash garbage. He's a Ultimate League Grass Knuckles. This is going to be really a very, very difficult matchup. Um, I want to go with you. Maybe this with the M Commander is better than Doctor Who right now. I'm, I'm expecting Lily or Black Eyed P. Okay, we're, we're gonna go with this. Unfortunately. It's kind of nice to develop Doctor Who a little, little bit earlier, especially since we have the grow option next turn, but there's Black Eyed P. Um, he, interesting he played this on Heights. It probably means he's not running Lily in this deck, or he just misplayed. We do play this. The question is where. Now, if he grows this, we're not going to have an answer later. I think this is what we do. Kind of a weird play. A Torchwood would do it, but I don't know. We see, we've seen two Ps already. It's very actually quite possible he's running Torchwood. There's that. All right. Very good. So this makes a good trade. This is a two for one. This is also a deadly that he's going to have to front or else it's going to draw a bunch of cards. Plus we're drawing cards, so, and this did three, this did two. Oh, 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 don't mess, man. Do not mess. Uh, yeah, I think so. What if he grows that, though? Okay, is there a different play? We can double up Doctor Who. We can also... Let's... Didn't want... This has five health. He's gonna need... I guess Spike Weed Sector could do it, but still, if he just Spike Weed Sectors, it's still fine. We have another one. No. Wow. This is going to kill both of these. Oh, wait. It might block by then. Come on. Got to roll some ones. There you go. There's a one. All right. So this trades well. We're in really good shape here. Come on. One more one. <laughs> It'll kill the Bananasaurus Rex. It's such a big deal. Yes. <laughs> yeah, baby. That's how you roll them dice. Goodbye, Banana. He really made the right play playing the Banana there because it was actually we got very lucky on the on the on the bounces there, and we just drew three cards. Good game, dude. Just concede. Give that man a concede button. Really, really, really. <laughs> We're just gonna do this again. Why the heck not? Why the heck not? I don't use Space Cowboy also, and I haven't really used it in a long time. Dang. That is right. <laughs> the lucky rolls. Ah, uh, I think we rolled two ones there. It was like two. What did he had three? So we had one, two, and and one. We rolled two two ones and a two. Harsh. The harshness is real. I'll, I'll write that down as a. That's kind of a mini highlight. He's drawing cards. Don't want. We're gonna brain freeze him. <laughs> we have. <laughs> Yay, mommy! It's le it's lethal anyway. Unless he rolls double threes and a two, now it's dead. Now he's this man is just concede right now. This guy can concede right now, and he has no way of taking out a two two in the water with one of his powers. So it's guaranteed lethal, actually, even if he blocks here. Goodbye. See you later. That's what I'm talking. <laughs> I really did not think that would work. To be perfectly honest, perfectly honest. Um, 20... Is it 29 already? It's the 29th. It's one month till Christmas, ya guys. Not till Christmas, till Halloween. What the heck am I even saying? Game two. Uh, 
let's get this game going. I'll write down this highlight. Cowboy, lucky, rolls, dang. Wait, cowboy, lucky, rolls. Right. Lucky rolls. I like those lucky rolls. Uh. <sighs> These don't freaking work against him or her. We'll keep one just to absorb the pain. The pain? Do we keep both of these? What are we looking for? A better two? I guess this goes on the ground. This will go on heights. Well, this should be fine. In fact, if we can double grow this imp, that would be amazing. This goes on the ground because it doesn't die to scorch. This one does. Riding those lanes like a boss. Oh! What? What is... What does Solar Flare have? It must be Scorch. Even more Spore, I think she would have just thrown out there to prevent us from drawing a card. What did we just get? Oh, it's a Gourmet card. Okay, I have to read this thing again. I'm not up to date here. Plants and the plant hero can't be healed. Solar Flare, we'll see. When played, all plants get minus one, minus one. Are you kidding me, man? Holy crap. This is a three cost sneezing zombie too. This is amazing! <laughs> Our luck today! I had the worst luck yesterday, so today's gonna make up for it. Yeah, guys. That Rust Bowl deck. Everyone's running freaking dragons. And... You must have top decked that. Would have used it last turn. Oh, man. You're gonna regret not killing that before. So I think we actually. This does die to Berry Blast. Wait. Okay. I'm a little confused what just happened. Um, this could die. Well. Goat. What's better? I mean, if this gets blast, let's let's just do this. This is the play. Hey, Yucko. We'll have the option. This, if this dies, we'll just have a three three, which is fine. If our opponent has nothing, then we're coming into four, turn four of the three three, and we're doing good. Lux, <laughs> just keep luck score today. <laughs> I wonder what the right time to use this is going to be. We're going to surprise the heck out of it. it. Happens to be the BC class. I can't wait till this is a Ven card. This is going to be out in the next few weeks, you guys. I just can't wait till. I can't wait till this is out. The BC class is going to have an answer to a really good answer. Field clear. This is a field clear card. Yeah, think about it. Technically. Uh, right now, we're actually going to grow the rooster, even though it's probably going to get blocked. Uh, we'll lose, a, we'll lose a, a bunch of damage actually growing the rooster here. We'll lose two damage, probably. Um, I just don't want the rooster to die to super or weed whack we, or, or scorch, actually. Mushrooms. We're going to grow the rooster. <laughs> It'd be nice to stick something here. Rolled a one, and it hit anyway. <laughs> How lucky are we getting here? It's not fair. Uh, it looks like three and one. This is definitely not the time for sneezing. Um, we do want to kill this too, so... That looks pretty good. Man, this roost... If he just makes a play here, uh, it's not going to be happy. Look at these loudmouths getting it done. The tempo is real. I'm so excited if there would be... I wish just Hover Goat cost two. I know it would be a really, really good card, but I feel like the Beastie class needs just one OP card like that in order to be launched into the meta. I sneeze all over his tacos. Ew. Ew. Nix it. How about nix the comments? Um, this card... Watch this guy get hard to choke. Sneeze on the planet. Uh, duh, duh, duh. Transport, what is this? Pass? <laughs> Solar Flare's had enough of us. Enough brain freeze for one day. This is just such a harsh board right now. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. I'll definitely take it. And we're 3-0 with this amazing deck. Man, we didn't even get to play the Sneezing Zombie, though. And thank you so much, Outdated Cafe. Look at your... Looky now, I catch up. Tap the link. I'll, I'll definitely chat, tap it. What you got? Catch a mechanic. This is a very similar deck to what I wanted to use. Got Lily. 
Uh, no healing, interesting. I was gonna do with Dr. Pepper, so it's a... Using this as a three. This actually is a good idea, because if you're tempoing... You're ba if, in tempo decks, you're basically not fronting their minions, usually. In the Lily kind of decks, which ends up that there usually ends up being a build, nice buildup of minions on the field. Uh, Fire Rooster is probably the best of these three. Uh, this isn't really good against. So these are better. Don't need two of these. All right, it's a, it's a hand. There's another. So the flare. This will probably get busted, but then it, it makes the rooster into a thing, and we'll have something to grow. It happens to be this is a very circumstantial card. Ditch one cowboy and put in a vampire or a botanist. Nah, I haven't even seen him throwing him. If we mulliganed one. Let's see how this goes. And dang, we don't have a plana. It's probably gonna just end up being the environment, which is really sad. Please give me a good three. What would be good here? Uh, Imp Commander would be pretty good. Man, we can't do this. So it's gonna be something, uh, just the environment here. Maybe if our opponent plays an environment, we're really far behind now. Let's see what we're, we're gonna do here. There's the area. We're taking so much heat. I don't like it. If you're blocking a galvanize, that would be awesome. I'm seeing a couple of flowers. I'm just afraid of Briar Rose right now. I think we have to play defensively, so... Unfortunately, we are backpedaling, folks. Dang. No. <laughs> wow we This is called getting wrecked. Getting wrecked with fry him up. Ooh, it's we're not in good shape. It's in the box. Galvanize. No, without that berry blast, we would have been able to break through everything. It would have been three and four on oh actually no, what's a lift? Acid rain, acid rain. We have to kill this thing. It's so sad. We're so close to losing here. Man. It was the hover goat. It was the hover goat that screwed us there. Uh, you know, if I would take out any card out of this deck, it probably would be the hover goat. That's what the hover goat actually made us lose. <laughs> What's that? We're sneezing zombie now. We're taking five. We're not going to win. Not this time, yeah, guys. Uh, nice rolls there. But again, it's just going to be a matter of him healing for a little bit here. We have no cards. <laughs> okay, what if we get Space Cowboy right now? That's not what we need. Let's see what we can do here. Acid Rain is probably very good here. Oh, we're still alive, actually. Block. Uh, freeze. I'll get this back. Boomerang. Uh, now we're gonna freeze. Do we acid rain here? We always freeze. I don't think we acid rain actually. Nope. We're gonna galvanize that. If we make a comeback here, It'll be comeback of the century. Again, he's gonna have extra sun here, but not not really cards. So, nerfing this really now he can't make a play. Ooh, that's good. This goes here. Yes, again, he, he thinks the strike through is gonna win, but it it won't. Mm, but it won't. 
So this happens now. Is the comeback of the century a thing? Do we not want him to make flowers? Where does this go? We need this to die. This will make sure that this doesn't this doesn't get like scorched here. He didn't use scorch yet, did he? Man, this will proc the block. Unfortunately, we didn't get this hover goat back in our hand, which would have been nice. Our opponent's got two. We're gonna make an imp though. The, the imp clogging this lane. Sorry, I'm not looking at the thing. Thank you, Data Cafe. 60, you got 60 packs, hold on, there's mini ninja, so that's clogged, it would have been nice if it would have gone in the other lane. We can actually come back and win this now? Man, you got 9 legendaries, that's pretty good. Give us a minion! Yes! This has got to go right here. Our opponent needs a strike through to win, or else I think we're going to get it here. Come on, hit the goat and the imp. That's fine. No! No, it just needs one damage! <laughs> No! <laughs> Bunshroom victory! Wow, we got so close there! Oh! More spore for the win! In fact... Oh, man. I guess I was gonna... Oh, come on, man. <laughs> no! We lost by a button shroom, literally. We almost made the comeback. That was really close. Ah! <laughs> button Shroom is OP, you guys! Nerf Button Shroom. Nerf Button Shroom. What should you craft? Uh, you know, lilies. Four lilies would be good. Pine clone, mixed up grave digger. These are the good cards. Craft. And Briar Rose. Wow. I think we're gonna go with these two. And ditch Doctor. Well, Doctor Who will be good later. This will also be good later. What are we looking for? A, a, a cheese cutter? Would be nice. I'm, I'm gonna play the option. This will give us at least several options. These will all come. This, this draws cards, so it's it's fine having this in the late game. Let's see what happens here. Man, I wouldn't mind seeing a click pee right about now. <laughs> that would be amazing. This would two for one. This would four for one, the click pee. Ooh. Ew. Maybe we should just wait till he plays something. Come I've never wanted to see Click be more. Actually if he has no, that's not what we wanted. Come on, man. Ouch. That's harsh. What are we gonna do about that? Let's see what happens. My name Jeff. I actually ended up Doctor Whoing in too. Hover Goat is useless. I probably should get rid of it. I'm just line dancing zombie or something. Okay, just gonna move it in. It's fine. Wow, wee! Look at this guy go. Okay, he didn't want it. He still had to. Did he get that banana bomb from the thing? Come on, man. Come on, boy. It looks like it's gonna be imp throwing imp. We could go Doctor Who. This is better. Uh, I play piano, actually. Oh, wee! Look at this freaking guy go. Give me a toxic waste imp. I want you so badly. Yes! Ooh! <laughs> nice shot. This is a 7 2. That's the problem. Gotta watch out for bonus attacks and stuff. Dang, this thing is growing so much. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Now we're good. Nothing like a good old gravestone to solve things, man. Dude, really? Wee! You're dead now! What a waste of a grocery. Turn four gravestone. Play around it, man. Fry roll. It should just be a command piece of trash garbage. Uh, I like the way this looks, actually. Where's the um? 
Where's that cowboy gonna go? Ugh, the spacing is not really good. But he's gonna maybe want to kill this, then we'll grow it. He's gonna go after this one, actually. Go after that, so the pogo's gonna live, so these two are gonna live. So the loudmouth is gonna die. I'm actually gonna do it here. It's such a weird calculation. I'm just thinking where the cowboy is gonna get the most value eventually. This will kill the 2 1 and then grow one of these. I'm gonna play. Be a 3 7. Gross. Uh, please use the poison oak in a ramp deck. Poison oak? It's much better to you. Why would I ramp to poison oak though? I could, for the same price, ro ramp to um, Dandelion King. I think that would work better. Nice try, dude, really. Guess we'll grow this just to make the trade good. Make the trade good right now. Man, he just wasted two cards. Again, a two for one. We're just outvaluing him here. Now we have a card advantage. Yo, Dad. Just investing a lot of these blooming hearts. Whew, I was really scared of that blooming heart early on, but not anymore. Now what? I think this thing's a piece of trash garbage. What's the play? Imp Commander and this. Environment? It's not gonna hit the though. This is also not gonna hit. These two, I guess. This is so weird. Oh, let's do it like this. They could have really grown the pogo there. I don't know. Maybe we'll roll a one and a two. Frank 49. Should I concede to this guy? When is it reset on? Okay. Banana nana. Moving it back to the ground. That's interesting. Okay, this will actually proc the block. No, no, it won't. Uh, we have four and three. That looks good. Yeah, baby. Maybe we should go three and three to draw cards. We'll do this later. Yeah. Plus, we can also freeze in case we play something massive here. We can use our brain freeze power. Leaving the option open. My Bananasaurus Rex! Does he have something to draw cards? No, he doesn't. So this happens. <laughs> this will actually get bounced now. It'll kill it and get bounced. That's interesting. Oh, please don't block! No, oh, that messes it up 100% of the time. No! <laughs> Piece of trash garbage. He could have actually... That was stupid. He shouldn't have used that. Acid rain, acid rain. We're gonna. We just draw, drew two cards, by the way. That's nice. So we got two, four, and one here. Gross. Two, four. This is deadly and draws cards, and we can just brain freeze him to death. Even bonus attack does not do anything here. Speaking of poison oak. This man is dead, speaking of Poison Oak. And um, we actually, this will do two, this is five plus five right here, actually. <laughs> uh, we win. That is, he didn't get time, yeah, anyway. Five, and then it'll hit again. And draw two cards. And draw more cards. Wow, I almost blocked. Four and one. Man, we're winning quickly here, too. The quickness is real. It's going on everyday highlights. Fry is at high noon. Yeah, it's baby Fry. He's making a racket today. Should you get Neptuna? Good hero to get. Good good if you want a zombie hero. Good. For beginner players, I would maybe suggest more like Grass Knuckles. That's a great hero to learn this game with. Ah, good old Tempo Grass Knuckles. Haven't played in a long time. Do Neptuno with Warlord and Mix of Grave Digger. I did that. It's called the Impter Galactic Warlord. It's one of my first set two decks, actually. You can look it up on YouTube. Lag? Oh, I'm not lagging. You must be. I've dropped about 300 frames, which is about two seconds out of 42 minutes. So. Wasn't me. Sistron might not have early answers to these. Hold on to one, it's not worth it. 
Rooster doesn't really do much in this matchup. This is good. It's a nice card. If he plays Spike Weed Sector. Do we want him to play Spike Weed Sector so we can play the goat into it? The only reason I wouldn't play this on the ground is Spike Weed. This is a really weird play, but we actually want him to play Spike Weed on two so we can go into it on three. And then we'll actually have infinite goats. Did the title not get updated? It's possible I didn't update the title. It is possible. Tis possible. Uh, this cheese cutter, if this draws a card here, we're gonna be in money. One of the best things to get is just freaking lunchbox now. Okay, yeah, the potato mine. Didn't end up making a difference. Making this a 4 4 would actually be pretty good. Shamrock it. Uh, if I did get Doctor Who here, though, I would go for it. Bimp, bimp, bimp. It's definitely good to play first. Now we can imp throwing a deadly imp throwing imp. Whew. The combo! It's probably better than Goat. Probably. Two admirals? <laughs> Goat double admiral. Okay. Uh, so interesting, we actually are going to imp throwing imp again. This is not an opportunity to play the Goat quite yet. Uh, a three would be nice. No such luck. Let's do this here. We'll play the Goat and grow this. At some point. Wow, he sacked an Admiral Navy Bean for her. It's okay, it's a decent play. Why are you potato mining, dude? Why would you do that? Are you insane? He doesn't want to take one damage. That was the worst play I've ever seen in my life. Holy moly, yay. Okay, you're dead. Actually, it's not even good for us now. <laughs> yay. <laughs> what is this guy thinking? I don't even know. Sometimes I just don't know. Uh, we're actually going to do this play, and the one we grow is this one. We want this to be uh, a card that he has to eventually kill, so. Now he also has a dilemma which one he takes. A link to what? Tempo Grass Knuckles? Just go to YouTube and type in Prime Up Tempo Grass Knuckles. There are. Fusion versions of it there. Just pick the most recent one. It's nice. Wow, this in Pogo is good. What, he mogged this one? No problem. Pogo works well here. It can get busted. Don't mess with Skunk Punk. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Man, we're not gonna draw from drawing a card here would have been so good. Whatever. I like potatoes. See you later, man. Okay, so that goes there for some weird reason. Why would put it in lane one? I don't I'm not really getting it. I'm not understanding what's happening. We have this full board and nothing to do. Very rare. Now what you gonna do? Slow play. And... Admiral. Yeah, let's use Brain Freeze power there. Good suggestion, game. And... Come on, man. Not getting lucky this time. This goat is not happy. We're gonna go with Pogo here. We want the four damage to hit. That's pretty important. This energy drink zombie is the only force of nature we actually have in the field right now. Stack needs energy drink zombie. It would be good. You'd have to take out either Imp throwing Imp or Doctor Who then, though. You did bust it. 
Um, yeah, but that's not gonna work, dude. Okay, that'll work. I wonder why the spike weed sector went there, though. He doesn't realize this, this moves. No, oh, and this dies now? Good play, man. Harsh! He's still down to eight, but it's time to make a move on here. Man, I wish I could get this goat. A goat would be amazing here. This is so bad. Let's just freaking, you know what? Maybe something good will happen. Wow, if this imp commander would hit, that would be amazing. I want to go so badly. Come on. <sighs> Impossible. We need just one of our environments. We're going to be good to go. Loudmouth wouldn't be bad here. Goat would be amazing. There's Loudmouth. I think we Loudmouth this one. know what the Citron is doing. Some random person playing random cards. No! It's, he just has a hand of answers. He has really no offense. That's totally fine. Double strike banana. Wow. If we... No, we can't block. It just dies. <laughs> Such a sad game. It's galvanized. Where is my, my... I just need one of my cowboys and we're good. There you go! <laughs> we have been answered. Five and five wins. I, I'm gonna do this. It's gonna be freeze and galvanize the cowboy. This is, this is gonna win here. What could he do right now? Even if he put a 4-4 four, four here, it still wouldn't work. We're going to galvanize him. He has no blocks left. He It seemed like this guy had something going, but it just ends up being too slow. That can't be hurt. That doesn't matter. Yo, dad. Yo, dad on your head. And you don't even need the freeze. The freeze is redundant. Yo, dad. Actually won that game. Damn, this guy's dead. He's deader than my dad. No, that's not nice. Come on, man. Ah, poor Citron. Look, mommy, it's lethal. <laughs> exactly. Exactly everyday highlights. Got him. Man, these cowboys. These cowboys, though. I'm beginning to think that the goat is a useless piece of trash garbage, so goodbye goat. Um, I'm gonna add in a fourth cowboy. And... Uh, what was the other card we wanted? Should I make some wholesale changes on this deck just to make it good? Uh, it's still fun, I'll keep this in. Uh, cowboy, we're gonna add in one more environment, I believe. We'll do this one. This is what? Bullseye? It's deadly and strike through. This is better. He's dead. And what else are we missing? Mixed up grave digger. Yeah. <laughs> ah, we have one. It's really a way we can make this deck better. We'll go with the one mixed up. This guy's dead. Okay, should we make this into a real deck? Kinda like the cowboys though. Cowboys are fun. Okay, we'll do this as the fun deck. This is the new version of it. I'll take a couple screenshots. I like taking two just because it makes Knox very happy inside. Very warm and fuzzy. Blind Dancer would be good in this deck. I could make it better. I wanna, I'm wanna. i going to stick it out with the... Uh, it happens to be with the imp, the, the loudmouths are very good with the imp synergy in this deck. Let's just turn it kind of into an imp deck. And again, Imposter still would be better 
Ah, uh, then she's cut her, but she's scored us more fun, and we're going for the fun. The Cowboys have been winning games, yeah. It still makes up Gravedigger is better than Cowboy. Mix up Gravedigger will win more games than Cowboy, guaranteed. But Cowboy's fun, 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 fun. His area 22s are pretty good too. Okay, Nightcap. You really don't need any Pogos against Nightcap. Let's see if we can get a one here. Yeah, baby. I wonder if I should ditch Pogo. It's a decent card. I think we'll keep this. The Fire Rooster is really good against all the mushrooms and garbage. I'm gonna change the deck list. Just give me one second. Have some patience, you guys. I can actually do this at the same time as I play. I don't expand it. And so we just fire rooster it next turn. That wasn't his super, was it? No. He, this is also a great play. This is better. In case he, he buff shrooms. Actually, if he buff shrooms, this is even better. Hey, this is better than... Well, he, if he berry blasts this one, eh, there's probably a couple things that could go wrong there. Man, pff, actually it would have been better because then we could have nailed the ceiling. We have a blow just in case this turns to something amazing here. What is in the box? Seedling? No! What just happened? He gets a 5 drop that kills our fire rooster? Come on, man! What a piece of trash garbage. We can't even blow that either. <sighs> Harsh. Okay. <laughs> That's such a lucky seedling. No, it looks like my luck is expiring slowly but surely. What's that? Make it rain. Man's making it rain. Okay. Taking a lot of heat here. Holy moly, rolls a one, rolls a two. Ah! Oh! Another two would be nice. This really, does this help us though? Not great though, not wonderful, but it works. He's just gonna have a little more removal and just win here. Mayflower. Ooh, actually we're in the money. This is gonna make two M's here. In fact, if it curds lane two, come on, it'll be deadly. Please, yeah baby, imposter two. So not only does it kill that, but it gives us another imp in our hands. Man, getting it done. Wow, we're actually gonna win now. <laughs> he has two cards. We have an imposter and a Poco and all other kinds of garbage, and he just wasted a Mayflower on Toxic Waste him. That's why he got her on Spiruses. Now what do we do? It's three. This for sure goes here. This goes here. It draws cards, and we'll just blow whatever he plays. Out of the sky. We're actually going to win this game now. <laughs> it's just a matter of him not having a good play for one turn. That messes him up. That's the way it is in basically all trading card games. And, yeah, nice try, dude. I appreciate the try, but we're draw definitely drawing an extra card. More cards! To mess with Imp throwing Imp. Regular Imp value. Don't get the Imp Commander, please! Yes! It healed! That was actually the best of those three. We have more Imp throwing Imps. <laughs> ah, cowboy. Oh, I don't have a good lane for it, though. Ooh, I see three. So we want to go, let's go with this, it'll just be damage, and we'll play the environment somewhere. One of these dying is good actually for us. Let's get end up drawing a card. Huh. Mm -hmm. Wow. Why? This dying is fine. Where does this go? Here? Do want to kill that 3-3 three, three for some weird reason? I think we do, actually. Nah. Go face! Let's see if we can roll a 1 and a 2 here. Roll a 1. Now this actually probably does hit. And we draw a card. Yes, and 4 damage. 4 damage! This man is damaged! You are so damaged. Okay, that always goes there. Oh, we could go with Cowboy. What's up, Cowboy? To remove this unlikely pogo pogo is the most solid play <laughs> it's probably the least fun but the most solid one more turn till kernel corn okay seriously 
damage. That is fine. Get bounced. Get bounced upon. So now this dies, which is good, because now we can make another play next turn. And we're going to get an Amphibious, which is a 1 in 3 of getting Toxic Waste Imp. Again, there's just... No, there's 1 in 4. Because you got Fishy Imp. That does help. Ooh, nice play. You got Fishy Imp. Um, Swabby. Then you have Toxic Waste Imp and uh, and this guy, the clone, the last one I mentioned, of course. Uh, we're doing his down to one now. <laughs> it's got saved by Super there. Pretty good. This looks fine. And we'll just put the biggest, the beefiest one here. So now we have a strike through, we have a frenzy, and we need one damage here. I think we're gonna get it. Colonel Corn still doesn't work. Colonel Corn actually does not kill two of these cards, and he can only block one with it. Yay! <laughs> so slow. This is amphi it's amphibious nightcap. I wonder why this deck's not working. Okay, we have quadruple. Le we have four lethals here. They're all guaranteed to. Come on, man! And we're six and one, rolling with this deck. We just had that one sad game we lost. And it was actually close. We almost made the comeback. This deck is better now. Cowboy. Let's do daily challenge. Daily, daily, daily. Let's do it. Uh, what day is today? Thursday. Oh, it's Twisted Thursday. No one even cares. You and your opponent will both take one damage start each turn. Question is, can you outlast the smash? Featuring taco. I'm going to eat your taco. Daily! Everyone's like, Daily! We're, we're against the Smash. So this is Block City. Uh, why would we... I'm not holding on to Taco. I'm not... Ooh! Whoa! Ho, ho. Man! What a hand! What a hand. That's right. Take some damage, boy. Get damaged. You will get damaged! This is fine. Eh, Blooming Heart's a really good play, too. It's nice they have two awesome plays. Next turn, we can actually Blooming Heart and play this environment, uh, which would be good. We'll see what hat comes out of this reincarnation. It's freaking spit out. Spit out. Definitely not doing that. So it's going to be these two. Oh, I smell sumo. It's probably... Not, <laughs> it's very likely not going to be a sumo. This is actually a flower deck, it seems, so we're going to put it in four. In flower decks, yes. <laughs> we have outsmarted you, Sumo! Uh, uh, uh. And put it in the environment! Misplay! Definitely goes in the environment. Because then you can't get a second flower and you can't get something protected by it. And yeah. <laughs> we can, it just turned... It had a fever and it just like cooled down. Turned into regular potato mine. That's nice. Yo, dad. Yo, dad. Your dad. Okay, great. Yay, super. Now you can't use that on my Briar Rose. Very nice. Thank you. That's very nice of you. Uh, are there pine clones in this deck? No one knows. No one even cares. Yay. Hey, there's a vampire. Ha, 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 ha. Let's go right over here. This man is dead. Should I use this? Uh, we're going to get something better out of the reincarnation. So no one cares. Yay, two damage! We're doing three! And Vampire is biting the dust because it just damaged a flower. And we have Briar Rose on the... Oh, this could work. 5-5, five, five, make some Bananasaurus Rexes. Probably just go with the, uh, with the Dandelion King. Alright, I think we're ready. Are we ready? I think we're ready, guys. Sing it with me! Sing it with... Oh, wait, is this better? Uh, ready to sing? Yeah, we're definitely ready to sing. It's six damage. Do we kill this? Or just go face, maybe? Uh, longer this game goes, better. Uh, yeah. Well, it makes a good trade here. Nah, let's just do this. Sing it, guys! It's the way it goes. Haven't sang that song in a long time, which reminds me, I need to use Dandelion King more. Ramp to the Dandelion King. Ooh, I'm writing that down. Uh, we have been inspired by the second second day in a row we actually get inspired by the strategy decks. <laughs> it's forget me nuts, that's nice. Um, ramp to Dandelion King. 
Maybe. The solar flare. Sounds like fun, actually. Get whacked. This man's getting whacked. Get him whacked, pop. Get him. I want to draw a card. I think I'm going to play this. Pretty good. Oh, this is a flower, too. <laughs> yuck, 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 yuck. Don't mess with the flower value. I'm hungry. Me hungry. Okay, so that's gonna die. My forget me nest just leaves a nibble here. What the heck is this again? End of turn, destroy a random zombie, make a puff shroom with team up there. And it's a flower. It's a flower. And it's strike through. We're getting all the cool cards this time. Uh, forget me. This is the play, actually. Uh, the question is, do we really want an environment here? I think we just heal our face, actually. This prevents him from playing any tricks here. Which is good. I just don't want this getting nibbled. Yeah, baby! Reincarnation! Tarnations! So this is from the Cosmic Flower. This doesn't really help us here. I, I, I want to play the Witch this next turn. Are we going to win? I have to play the We have to see the Witch in action, you guys. <laughs> I love how that slid over while it was transforming. That was awesome. Oh no, he took one! Come on, man! I never get a chance to play these freaking cards! It wouldn't have triggered anyway. Because both of those guys would have died. Like, I mean, we could have witched and nerfed. Anyway. This man is dead. Alright. What's going on, Novelaz? But um, they see me growing. So much for the witch belly. How did he die? Because the part of the condition of that was that we're taking damage at the beginning of each turn. Uh, Doctor Who is better than Rooster, I believe. Double Who. It's tempting. We're actually gonna get rid of Imp Commander, see what we get. Oh, do we keep double, double Doctor Who? Is it too slow? Nah, I think double Who's worth it. Actually, it's just doing a gourmet deck with Brain Freeze. Again, gourmet doesn't actually have any synergy, so it would be like, oh, we're doing gourmet deck, but it's kind of, kind of cheesy, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Okay, the question is, if this goes in the grab... He, did he draw cards? One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six, so he didn't draw. So he either has Super, which will kill this regardless, or he has Geyser or Scorch. So uh, the Scorch really... Because of Scorch, we're going to play this here, even though we do have this environment, which is awesome. But we'll, we'll get a shot out of the environment later. It's almost going to be good. He actually has, like, you know, healing environments and stuff like that. It's kind of good to cover, so... Interesting. Interesting. Now what? Uh, okay, this actually draws a card. What if this helps us? <laughs> Only a gas giant. Uh, this is weird. I'm gonna do this and blow, I think. Kind of a waste of a blow. So you know what? Let's get him, give him his one shot out of the lily. I almost could have played this too. I'm gonna go for blow. Twin sunflowers, cool. And Scania Scorch, no. I would like to get the sunflowers here, that would be pretty awesome. I just wanna draw the card with the discount. Yeah, baby. Looks like a flower deck, actually. Wouldn't be surprised if we saw Briar Rose. Now, getting something, yeah, okay, it's free. It's free, you guys. I'm actually gonna do this and uh, environment and cryo, I think. Pretty good way of taking out this lily. This will probably get hit by. Um, okay, it's still the same play. Free cryo brain. I'll definitely take it. Um. We could grow Doctor Who next turn. Throwing imp. I think 
this is gonna go, go in the water, maybe? This is tough. Really, we need to grow here. We could just make the strongest play, which is this. If it kills these, so if he grows this, this will live. I can't really do damage. Let's just do the strong play. Do the strong play right now. I think getting this field empty for the cowboy is probably the way to go. In fact, this was turn six, so we're gonna have these two next turn. Coffee grounds? No, oh, it dies. Man! This guy's getting it done here. Oh, wow, we. We're in trouble. This does five. Whew! Good play. Do we do this next turn? Oh, we do, actually. I'm, I'm seeing imp throwing imp here, actually. Actually. way if something gets removed. We're still good. And then acid rain. Yeah, baby. <laughs> That's why he has the rain. Holding off on it. No! Bad! <laughs> uh, I guess we buff self. What just happened? Oh. Go! Wait, so that's, it's only one imp, really. Come on, give us toxic. Let's go. Swabby, the worst one. Give this man some better luck than that. Oh, we're not in great shape. If this even had been toxic, but... Uh, okay, he'll do one extra damage here. Kill Swabby? Um, thank you? I think that's actually really good for us. He should not have used that there. I didn't want to kill kill my zero. Can grow this perhaps. There's the area. It's actually like this. Really don't need to strike through. I wouldn't kill this anyway. If we had deadly, I would have gone for it. Gotta kill the Swabby as soon as possible. How did I get Gas Giant? Um, I got this from Dr. Spacetime. Doctor, who cares? So we're hitting him for five, five and three wins. As of now, we're actually doing this. He'll probably block the Gas Giant, perhaps? Wait, but now if he blocks the Gas Giant, this doesn't work out. This was a very weird play. I don't like it. Because this is gonna die if he fronts the gas giant, which hopefully will deter him from doing that. Right now, this usually this almost always wins. Okay. Again, this is still only three damage. And <laughs> that's cute. This is frenzy. Okay, here's Frenzy Strike Through. Will this do extra bonus attacks? This is so weird. So this, anyway, does three and three. I think this is actually the play. Well, maybe this is the play. Oh no, this is the play. Five, seven, three and three. Interesting. This is usually lethal, actually. He needs to roll double threes and a two, so the moment we see a one, we win here. And there's a three. There's a three. Come on down. <laughs> wait, will this do two bonus attacks on the... Wait, no, it wasn't friend. Come on, man. He actually blocked there. <laughs> Not cool. <laughs> That's so stupid. He's going to have a really hard time with this gas giant here. It's in the box. I guess this goes here and this goes here. Because why not? Can grow that cowboy. He's gonna still have a very hard time surviving here. Double strike, potted powerhouse. 
for the win. <laughs> the heck is that? We still win. Rowan. Wait a second. Now he needs double. Well, oh. No, wait, this one dies. Uh, no, it's lethal. It's lethal. Because the flower dies. Now he needs double. No, he can roll double ones. You know what? If he gets double ones here. Actually, this had double strike. Oh, it's really good we grew this. Oh, my goodness. Wait. Oh, right, I know, that died anyway. Oh, okay, right. Yeah, I forgot about Gas Giant's ability. I never play Gas Giant ever. Ah, I forgot about the damage, right? It dies. Oof. I will screw that up royally. <laughs> I have no experience with this card. Yeah, Gas Giant dies and wins. Whoa, that could have gone horribly wrong. In a slightly different stat scale. Come on, man. Doing really good here. This gas giant good. Again, I really haven't used him in a deck. I guess I tried him a little bit in a couple times, but. <sighs> Maybe in an aggressive deck, gas giant would be good, because then when he's fronted, he. An aggressive splash deck? I have to think about it. Double imp commander. Could be good. Imp, imp. I think we're actually gonna. Okay, we need some more early game now. This is all right. Mix up Gravedigger is amazing against Captain C, so we can't give that up. I think we're gonna go for this. We'll put it on the ground just so we can get more acid rains. Really budget deck? No, it's five legendaries. Used to have Thea. See if we would have done this one turn later. It's likely we'll get a two here though. We have a lot of a lot of twos, and even him throwing it would be really good here. By a rooster. Where does this go? We just have to calculate the cowboy right now. I think a cowboy's gonna end up going in. I think this just goes here. Uh, Witch Hazel in the control deck. Witch Hazel is gonna be a really hard card to pull off. It's gonna take a lot of work to make Witch Hazel effective. It's interesting. This is why Imposter is <laughs> so much better than freaking guy. I say let's do this. This way the, the rooster has a 50-50 of killing the um, killing the lily of the valley. Unless it's Grosho. Which it's not. No! It's missed! Come on, man! He's moving that to lane one. Cool play. What? Why not just move that to lane... Why is he growing this... I'm very confused there. This dies to acid rain now. That was a horrible play. Ew. Ew. I think acid rain... You know, if he plant foods this... Okay, let's do this here. Let's wait if he fronts the rooster then. Yeah. This will actually make him more likely to put another minion on the field. They seem pretty um, intent. He actually had bonus tag, so I didn't put it here. He seemed pretty intent and not. Man. We're still getting fudged up here. Let's see what happens. Two. Ah, uh, this is good here. We're probably gonna mix up Grave Digger. We really don't want this attacking again. Knock! In fact, if you got time to shine here, this actually saved us. <laughs> they see me grow and still frozen. Still have to play around plant food, I suppose. That's pretty nice. Draws a card. We're in not the greatest of shape. It's gonna be next turn. It's gonna be a mix of Grave Digger, which will hopefully. That's fine. If that's all he's got, if 
that's his answer this turn. Uh P. Man, too bad I can't answer rain. That would have been cool. This is fine though. This is three. We're gonna draw a card. We're gonna be able to make some grave in front of this. Now I, I would really like a small minion here. I don't know if we're gonna get it. It's another card. There you go. There's our small minion. Perfect! Now we can clog all the lanes. We really, we're just playing around bonus attack for now, so this is great. And both of these big guys will die, so he's gonna have to develop a new one, and yeah, we're good. A lucky Bananasaurus Rex would be pretty harsh here. It's Onion Rings. It's a little too slow, I think, because this, this guy's gonna get it done here. Alright, let's see what's in the box. I need to check. 5-5 five, five here would be cool. Not the mix of Grave Digger here, dang. Got, um, got the worst the worst combination possible. This being exactly here, this was basically the worst. I guess I guess the only thing that really mattered was the mix of Grave Digger being anywhere except here. Now we're on an empty slate, but then what this this is really good. It's gonna be again, he's gonna need a card and a bonus attack, I guess, to to get him here. I guess plant food is gonna win no matter what. We can't block both of these. Yeah, we can. In fact, Acid Rain. That's weird. Oh? Wait, maybe this should have gone here. I'm playing around plant food, I guess I'll just commit to that. Acid Rain actually will make us win if he can't grow this, this guy anymore. Everything in his hand is a 4-4. Four, four. Oh, it's double strike? No! Ah, oh, now we lose. Dang, if I would have put this here... If I would have put this here, we would have won. I, I regretted it for the moment I did I was like, why don't we do lane one so he doesn't somehow kill us with a double strike? I think he Bananasaurus Rex. Come on, man. Uh, that was my misplay. I, we, I, I think we would have... I think we would have had that. I'm pretty sure we would have had that one. That's my, that's my bad. I should have played in one. You, you guys are right. You guys are right. I, my bad. My bad. Ah, too bad. I I just thought I was so intent in playing around plan food that I wasn't playing against the. We knew he even had a double strike in his hand. It was, I right when I played it, I was like, no, oh, why? Should have thought two seconds more. I think before you make plays, you guys. Um, this is the least good card here. <sighs> it's kind of, I kind of don't, I, I'm look, I see two, three, four. I kind of really don't want to get, get rid of Toxic Waste Imp against Grass Knuckles because it's really good. Go. Uh, this goes here, so we can area 22 next turn. I don't even mind seeing Spike Weed Sector. There's that. Area 22 will be amazing. And if he grows this insanely... Well, fertilize? I haven't seen fertilize in ages. Uh, Pogo's quite good here. It'll be probably Pogo next turn. Maybe we'll go with this. We'll see. <laughs> He's like, pass! Pass? Doctor Who pass? What is he gonna do? I don't know, Doctor Who. This is the play. That's a nice play by him. Let's see, maybe this card will help us. So our priority right now is killing Lily. Give us uh, something good. It's not bad. Especially with the Doctor Who on the field. Hmm. Chances of getting an imp are very unlikely. We could go with this. Is that insane? What if he has plant food? Let me lose. Could go with Pogo. This does. This will get the next one will be extra. It's tough. If he has plant food, he's gonna win, but if he doesn't, then we're gonna kick his touch. Kick him right in the tushy. This will end up killing the lily too. 
Guess he could put a minion here. Cosmic Imp needs a buff. I haven't really used it. It doesn't seem to be worth it. The Deadly doesn't make it good. Oh, he's gonna grow this one. Good play. Good old play. My banana. Wait. Come on, man. Good play. Harsh. <laughs> banana value. Okay. Lily is such a good card. How do we deal with this? Pogo? Bounce the Lily at the same time? We can't bounce, we have to kill the Lily. The Lily is the one we have to kill right now. Let's just do this. This this will set up a good play for next turn. Pogo and Blow, it's too slow. He's just gonna replay the Lily. It's not gonna really solve the problem long term. Lily's a really a card that you can't really bounce it unless he's grown it already. It's not really worth it. So we're taking another six. We still have eight health. It's enough to work with. We'll really be able to play Pogo and some more stuff next turn. Pass! He had nothing! What is he holding in his hand? How did why did he he pass? They were gonna draw a card? And now we're in the money. <laughs> That's it now. Are you kidding me, man? Let's see what we get here. I'm kind of interested in this. Uh, something cheap would be cool. Not that cheap. <laughs> Piece of trash garbage. I think it's just Pogo. I don't even think we play this. It's just gonna end up procking a block of a better card. Ugh, useless. Now what do you have? Dickweed Sector. He just has defensive cards in his hand, maybe. Okay. Still bounce this huge party time. What a weird play. He's playing around like smelly zombie or something. On turn four. He just has a bunch of useless protection cards in his hand. How did that get blocked? Come on, man. I guess this will draw like a draw either way. I can't really take this out. Okay, goodbye, cosmic. Useless piece of trash, cosmic sports. He gave me freaking a zero cost baseball zombie. I could have played it for free and I chose not to. That's how bad that was there. goes here except for this well no we can play the environment guess that's it and we have this and blow that's a pretty good play actually this pogo can die I don't really need him anymore <laughs> donating money is fun sure dude I'll hit you up man Play the baseball and the dickweed for BM. It's a good play. Doesn't have fertilize. This man think he is. Super? I was not expecting him to have that in his hand. I have not been keeping track of his powers, which is something while you're streaming is basically impossible, but... Piece of trash garbage. Let's see if we can get this repeat boss. Did get it. I don't... Uh, maybe we do play this. Just for tempo. Maybe I should have covered this up. Oh, we. I think it's like this. Maybe baseball should have gone here. Anyway. 
This is pretty good. Deadly too. Cowboy. I was thinking Cowboy Frenzy. The problem is this Repeat Moss play in lane one is likely gonna proc the block and then kill us. So I'm playing around. I'm making making amends for the mistake we made last game by not making the play in lane one. We have to. That's our priority. The block really. This is this is the probably the the most safe play. Plus, if we roll a one and a two, we're, we're actually gonna win here. In fact, with this pogo, uh, well, no, we need the cowboy to hit. Let's see what happens. This guy is not. He skipped turn five. I'm just confused. My bananasaurus rex. That's a good one to get rid of. So this is just gonna kill everything. If this hits twice, we win. No wait, yeah. So if we roll a, a one here, roll a two, we could get still get a one and win. Ah, uh, because then it would proc the block in the Zuna. Anyway, we're still at six health with a full block meter. We're actually gonna win this game, most likely. Uh, we one off. Should we do this now? Yeah. Um, I hope I don't regret that. I really hope I don't regret that. Loudmouth, loudmouth in the lane that he's. Uh huh? Now we have three and three. That's the way to go. Actually, a repeat moss play in lane one could screw us over really badly right now. In which case, galvanizing the 2 1 and lane one might have been better there. He still has this freaking repeat moss. What does he have, though? That's just. It's two. So it's two plus two. Does he have one more? He needs one more. He's drawing cards though. Uh oh, he basically needs. <laughs> Look at this. That's amazing. Shamrocket. We're still good. Wait, no. We need. We need a block now. Come on. Three. Yeah, baby. Oh, uh, we're good. It's to make a difference what we grow here. Makes any difference. I think we're good. He needs to roll a one. Come on, man! Come on, man! Yes! Lethal! Rest in peace, boy! <laughs> what a way! Whoa! It was tense. The tensity was real. The tenseness was absurd. Yeah, baby! <laughs> yeah, baby! <laughs> Woo, eight and two. Eight and two, boy. <laughs> we actually won there. <laughs>